Okay, guys, why don't you tell me what you're dressed as? I'm here as Superman, the Chris Reeves version. Arrow from the show CW. Okay. And Poison Ivy. Black Canary. Okay, so let me ask you guys a quick question here, especially since we have Superman. How would Superman handle the Syrian crisis? Um, I think he would not get involved. <laughs> How about Green Arrow? Would he get involved? Popular answer, but, uh... Green Arrow? I don't know if heroes are supposed to get involved with conflicts of uh, interest. Poison Ivy would probably be on the uh, evil side, right? Of course. And how about you? Uh, probably stay out of it. <laughs> All right, so let me ask you guys, how much money did you spend making your costumes? Superman? Um... Maybe about three hundred dollars, some three fifty, maybe. Did you make it yourself? Parts of it. How about you, Green Arrow? Probably around two fifty to eighty. You made it yourself? No, I, I, I made pieces of it. Now, Poison Ivy. Those, those weren't. Those aren't real uh, leaves, I assume. Uh, no, mine was uh, probably around between two fifty and three hundred, and uh, parts of it I made myself. Parts I had help. Okay. sees the picture a little, they'll understand this question. Which part did you already own of your costume? <laughs> I own the boots, the fishnets, and I had to just buy the jacket and the swimsuit. All right. I'm proud of you for that, by the way. <laughs> All right. Let me ask you, in a fight, who would win, Elastic Man or Plastic Man? too wrapped up to get involved. <laughs> Probably nobody. They're pretty annoying, right? Yeah. All right, so... Elongated man. He's there definitely you know. smarter. There so you he know. would probably win, man. Who's the bravest superhero? I'd probably give it up for Batman, just because he doesn't have any superpowers and he's doing it by himself. I agree with that, yeah. Well, does Green Arrow have superpowers? Well, no, but... Yeah. As much as Bruce Wayne? He's up there. He's one of the richest. And he, he chooses not to have a, some sort of suit and flying machines. Yeah. Speaks a lot to his character, I think. I, I yeah. 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 Are you guys enjoying the show? Dude, perhaps. Enjoying the show so far? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. It seems like it's a great turnout this year. Is this your first Baltimore Comic Con? No. Yeah. Did you come last year? Yes. Yeah. Dressed? No. no. First time dressed to Baltimore. How do you make Philly? How do you make the leap from I'm just going to come as a regular guy to I'm going to come as not just Superman, Christopher Reeves Superman? Well, I'm not Henry Cavill size, sadly. Um, much to my wife's dismay, I, I haven't graduated to that level of uh, muscledom. So something in between maybe is a better fit for me. So. But when you're you're sitting there at home thinking. <laughs> What am I going to decide to go as? Yeah. And you decided Superman? How did you decide Superman? Yeah, well, we um, we have a big annual Halloween party that uh, has been superhero-themed for several years now. So we've done a number of different characters. Um, Captain America, Superman, the Joker, she's done Wonder Woman, a bunch of different things. So we try to cycle through and give everybody something new a little each time. So. Oh, is there merit? There's a marriage here yeah, between? Married. Okay. Yeah, oh, well, everybody's married. Oh, all right. Interesting. But you didn't go with the traditional, like, husband and wife superhero team. That's good. That's a little hacky, right? Oh, okay. You're right. I'm sorry. Not hacky at all. Okay, so final question. Ben Affleck as Batman. Ben Affleck. What do you think? Soup, I'll start with you, because you're going to be in the movie with him. What do you think? If he's good enough for Kevin Smith, he's good enough for America. Fair enough. I'm going to give him a chance. I think that he's, he has the look. I think he just needs to bulk up. I want a detective Batman, most of all. I don't want, you know, I want somebody that's going to do hand-to-hand -hand combat. Okay. I'm good with it. I like Ben Affleck. Yeah, I think a lot of the ladies seem to be okay with Ben Affleck. We'll see. He has to prove himself for me. So you're saying Daredevil wasn't enough to really prove it? I know. Daredevil terrible. Not sure what he was thinking. I, he needs to really step up his game for Batman for me. All right. Well, thanks a lot, guys. Have a good show. Thanks. Thank you.